the smoke screen laid. Engine room, lay smoke screen. Smoke screen laid, sir. Commander Winslow, attacking cruiser, port side. Very good, Pennington. Bearing, sir, 20 degrees. Left half rudder. Left half rudder. Torpedo control, the fire went on. Torpedo control. Torpedo fired, sir. Four torpedoes fired, sir. has just scored four direct hits of them. Very good. Those torpedoes sure put that cruiser out of action. Submarine, sir, off the starboard bow. Stand by for depth charges. Depth charge stations. Depth charges, one, two, and three fired, sir. Right, full rudder. Right, full rudder. Admiral Warburton, you're to be congratulated on the manner in which your fleet has conducted these maneuvers. Thank you, sir. Commander Winslow is also to be commended. I agree with you, sir. He deserves a lot of credit for the way he's readjusted himself after being transferred back to his command from Naval Intelligence. Order Commander Winslow aboard. I want to talk to him. Aye, aye, sir. Have that signal sent to Commander Winslow at once. years off our grades. It won't hurt us any, especially with the sinkers watching maneuvers. <laughs> Commander Winslow, Admiral Warburton's compliments, sir. You're to come aboard flagship immediately. Very well. This is it, Red. Cross your fingers. You said it, Don. And don't forget to present Lieutenant Pennington's compliments to the sinkers. Commander Winslow reporting, sir. Commander, I've sent for you to congratulate you on the skillful handling of your ship during the maneuvers. Thank you, sir. But the officers and enlisted men deserve most of the credit. I'm glad you realize that. We commanding officers must never forget that it's the spirit of the entire personnel that makes our Navy the great force that it is. Excuse me, sir. Thank you, sir. Supply ship SS Quarter Queen sunk off Tangita Island. 
Suspect organized sabotage. Respectfully request Commander Winslow be transferred back to my division at Pearl Harbor. Signed, Captain Holding, Naval Intelligence. The Quarter Queen is the second supply ship that's been lost attempting to reach Tangier Island. The first intimation that we've had of sabotage is this report from Miss Mercedes Colby. Mercedes Colby? Yes, she and her friend Mr. Gay were the only survivors of the Quarter Queen. Do you know them? Very well. I've worked with them before. They're both very intelligent girls. Oh, well, they're more than that, especially Misty. <laughs> well, tell me, Captain, what were they doing on the Quarter Queen? Well, Miss Gay is secretary to Blake, the contractor building the naval base at Tanchita. Miss Colby is the head nurse at the new naval dispensary on the island. What's so important about Tangita? Well, although it's off the main trade routes, patrols based there can protect our shipping lanes. Then the destruction of these supply ships is the work of saboteurs determined to prevent our building a base on Tangita. That's right. The fact that the Quarter Queen was torpedoed proves that the saboteurs must have a base somewhere in the vicinity of Tangita. That's why I'm sending you there, Winslow, to try and find that out. We'll do our very best, sir. I know you'll do that. Now, here's the island layout. Here at the northern tip is a gold mine. The only through road runs south from it, past this native village to round down a bay where the base is being built. You're southbound for Tangita tonight, Commander, under forced draft. Aye, aye, sir. And good luck. Thank you, sir. There's Tangita Island. We should be pulling into round down a bay in less than an hour. You'll be in command of the ship, Grady, while Lieutenant Pennington and I are ashore. All right, sir. Your first assignment will be to sail directly south 200 miles, then circle the island, closing in until you return to Rondana Bay. Yes, sir. Tangita looks peaceful enough. Yes. Yeah. 